convert five. Okay. The next question we got on the menu today. Convert five millimeters to inches. Five millimeters is half a centimeter. Um, yeah, okay, so... Because the world is a complicated place, we have developed multiple different ways to measure uh, multiple things. Like, we know that you can measure distances in, in millimeters, meters, kilometers... Um, you know, and that's like in metric, it's nice and easy. Like a thousand millimeters make one meter, a thousand meters makes one kilometer. But somewhere, somehow, some people decided that let's make a system um, where we got inches. Twelve inches make a foot. Three feet make a yard, and like a thousand six hundred or so yards make a mile. Someone said, "Yep, that sounds like the best way that we can measure stuff." And till this day, we still have to deal with converting between different units because some people are very adamant on keeping their um, on keeping imperial units. Um, it is what it is. We just got to do some math to accommodate that because it is easy to convert. Um, so we're basically looking for to do this conversion. We're looking for the number that is uh, millimeters. Whoops. Uh, let's get the brush millimeters per inch um, I think it's two twenty five point four millimeters per inch uh, yeah yeah twenty five point four millimeters per inch that is the conversion Okay, now we can easily say one inch is equal to 25.4 millimeters. Okay, now this is going to be a very important, not only in math, but across many different subjects, is to be able to know how to cancel out units. Um, so let's say we multiply this, like we're trying to find our... Um, number of inches that represent is represented by um, five millimeters per one inch so if we just multiply this by five uh, millimeters over I guess one because um, really is just five if you look closely you can see that the millimeters on the top here get neutralized by the millimeters on the bottom here even though they're just units um, if you see one on the top and one on the bottom, they will certainly cancel out each other. And I promise that's always the case. So this translates to equals a one inch times five. The millimeters got neutralized by the millimeters on the bottom over 25.4. Um, used to be millimeters, but those got neutralized out. So this is just equal to um, 5 over 25.4 inches corresponds to 5 millimeters. Let's pull out the calculator, the handy dandy TI-84, to uh, figure out what that is. 5 divided by 25.4. Answer to that, 0 0.196855, a couple decimals later, inches. Okay, um, that would be our final answer for converting five millimeters into inches. Just make sure that you have like a fraction like this that tells you the relationship of like how many millimeters per one inch. 25.4 millimeters per one inch or one inch per 25.4 millimeters. Yeah, stuff like that. You want to have that fraction and um, using that you can do a unit cancellation and just multiply it properly. Um, the units will cancel out and you should get your final answer in the proper units. Make sure you keep your units in line. Um, if your units go on the wrong side, you'll be in trouble. Sounds good. Uh, yep, so they got the exact same answer to the exact same decimal depth, so the above solution is good. Above solution is good. Now, wouldn't this all be easier if the entire world just agreed to use centimeters, meters?